Well, Teddy, welcome to, to Forest Green Rovers. Great to have you here. Thank you. Uh, how does it feel to sign for the club? Yeah, no, it feels it feels really good. Um, me and people around me have been speaking about it now for a while, so I'm just delighted that it's that it's done now and it can it can start to kick on you for say the season. It's been been going for a while. How long have conversations been in the in the pipeline? Uh, pretty much the start of the um, the summer. So when we, when I finished at Brighton for this season, um, yeah, I was speaking to my agent about it then. So they're interested, and then. My heart was kind of set on it then. I didn't really need to speak to too many other people. Um, so yeah, now I'm just just really happy that it that it's all done now. And I think this summer you ended a really long association with, with Brighton, didn't you? And that must have brought around a lot of different emotions and feelings for you. But why is Forest Green the right home for you? I just like the whole ethos of the club. And obviously they didn't have the best season last season, but hopefully um, we can get back back to League One um, next season. Um, and I think that's the aim for everyone here at the club. Um, and just brilliant manager, obviously, uh, I can pick his brain a little bit with football things. He's not a bad person to learn off. Um, so no, it's just, um, yeah, everything about the club that's um, really intrigued me, really. I mean, you mentioned Duncan there. Is he something of a selling point just in himself? Yeah, 100%. The character, obviously, he had a fantastic career in the Premier League and, and in Scotland. Um, so yeah, 100%. I did, um, there are loads of players that would that would jump at um, playing here for him. And what about conversations in, in je well, I guess, with him and other people at the club? How, how have you found them? What have you spoken about? Yeah, every, everyone's been really nice. Just um, talk to me about the club, how, how it's run, like what happens here, um, and then what the aims are for for this season, where they see me, how I fit into, you know, how, how everything works here, and everything everything's been been perfect. Yeah. And let's go back to, I guess, the, the last couple of seasons. You had a couple of loan spells, haven't you? Aberdeen and Crawley. Yeah. Have those experiences been for you when you reflect on them? Uh, yeah, really important. Um, Aberdeen was my first loan. I loved it in Aberdeen. I thought it was was brilliant. Um, had some really good experiences up there. Played with some really good players and in some brilliant stadiums, which is which is really good. And then obviously at Crawley last year, it was a bit stop-start. Just failed to get fit um, for the first few months and then loads of manager changes um, and then everything started going really well and then obviously picked up a bad injury towards the end but um, yeah I'm grateful for both opportunities that um, that I had and yeah I've learned a lot of things. And then I think you were at Brighton for over a decade weren't you and yeah. obviously the evolution of that, that club they've gone yeah. through great things. How, how much did you learn just in general as that decade or so at Brighton? Yeah, loads. I joined when, joined when I was 10. I've made some uh, brilliant bonds there with, with, some, with certain people. Um, and yeah, the, the club's changed so much since I was there. We didn't even have a training ground when, um, when I joined. And now what it's become is just a, uh, just, a, yeah, just a brilliant club. And I'm thankful to them. I've learned a lot, but it's time to move on now. And what about you as a player, Teddy? How would you describe yourself to anyone who hasn't seen you? Um, I'd say... I'm more of a box to box midfielder. I like to get forward. I like defending. Um, good runner, and I like just playing in the middle, getting on the ball, and making things tick. Um, I'd say, yeah. And what's the ambition for for you this season coming in? What's the goal? The goal for I think for everyone here, including myself, would be to um, try and get promotion, uh, be as close to the top as we can, and then just for me, it's just to get loads of minutes under my belt play games, play here um, and just help the team to achieve um, their goals in the best way I can.